Hey guys, it's the look of the Irish, and today we are going to be doing. Oh, oh, oh yay! Okay, so I went to Target, Ulta, Charming Charlie, and Hot Topic. I didn't intend to go to Hot Topic, but it was calling my name, and I like nerdy stuff, so we're gonna start with that. So, first things first. Okay, first things first. I'm the realist, first of all. Second of all, um. I want to do a video for you guys. Um, Strawberry17 does these videos. Um, I want to do like a casual cosplay type of deal um, because I like nerdy things, as I said. And also, I have this great little like TARDIS dress, if you know what Doctor Who at all. And I have like a sonic screwdriver and I have a little TARDIS earrings. And so today, uh, with that idea in mind, I got these. Yay! They're little TARDIS shoes that I got from Hot Topic. And look! They see me grow on the inside! How awesome is that? So yeah, I my nerdy self couldn't not say yes to them. <laughs> um, and it was buy one get one 50% off and I was already getting something and so Nick's like, hey you should get those for your casual, casual cosplay video. And so, yay! That's one of my first things. Second, okay. So, my friend Tabitha, she knows that I love this movie that I grew up with, and she got me a couple of bits and bobs from Hot Topic from this movie for Christmas. And so I was like, oh yeah, this is awesome, this is great. And so when I went in there today, I had forgotten that they had that merchandise. And so when I went in, I was like, oh my gosh. And I just, I just couldn't walk out there without something. And so, I got... These tank top, oh my gosh! Okay, so if you don't recognize this, this is Kiki from Kiki's Delivery Service, and the little cat is Gigi, and I love Gigi. Um, it's a Miyazaki film, and I literally, I watched this movie over and over and over again as a little kid, so like, I just, it was nostalgia, guys, I couldn't. So that's it from Hot Topic. Um, let's go Target. Yay. Okay, so for some reason, okay, you best get your butts out to Target right now because for some reason on certain items in the Sony Kashuk line, they're like mega on clearance. Like I ain't, I ain't messing with you. I'll show you. Okay, so my girl Tati here on YouTube talks a little bit in one of her videos about like dry brushing and I was always interested in it and so I, it's always been in the back of my mind and then I see this Sonia Kashuk dry brush and I was like oh okay cool how much is it it's on clearance for $1.98 are you kidding me are you kidding me so I was like uh yeah please thanks so I went ahead and got this so I'm telling you get to Target because Ain't nobody beating that deal. Okay, sticking with Sony Kashuk, I got the little Quint, no, the little six palette of eyeshadows and precious gems. Again, this is like half off. It was $14.29 and now is $7.14, guys. I'm not kidding you. This is like an awesome deal. And so, ooh, I'm gonna open it for you. Okay, so opening her on up. I'm really excited because like, Eyeshadows are my weakness, and no matter how many I buy, I keep buying more. And so, look at how pretty these jewel tones are. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I'm loving already. Like, look at this gold. Look at it. Oh, I had some swatches from Ulta earlier. Sorry. Um, so that's the gold color. Let's try this bronzy brown. Ooh, hoo, hoo. I'm so excited. Oh, and that those two together girl like I'm a Michigan fan and our colors are blue and gold you'll see that in a little bit when from what I got from Charming Charlie's but wouldn't that be cute to do like a game day eye look let me know if you want that tutorial okay moving on I got some stuff from Elf um okay so I've been wanting something like the puff off from Benefit that just came out, but I didn't want to spend all the money. And so I was at Target and looking at e.l.f. stuff and I found this. It's the e.l.f. Studio Eye Refresh and it's got like the little metal tip on it that's supposed to be oh so cooling under the eyes. And it says, 
The cooling sensation of the rollerball brightens and refreshes the eye area to help alleviate under eye puffiness and dark circles. So, I mean, that sounds awesome. So, I went ahead and picked this up. And then, okay, I went a little crazy with these today. I don't know why. I don't really have a lot of lip colors because I think they intimidate me a little bit. But today, as you see, we'll see at Ulta, I got some of these like jumbo lipstick things. And so I got the jumbo lip gloss stick in Pink Umbrellas. How cute is that name? And then I got, ooh, the Jumbo Lip Gloss Stick in Movie Star. How cool is that? Okay, so, and then, is this the last thing? This is the last thing. Okay, so I have little uh, samples of eye primers um, from Lorac and Urban Decay, but I haven't gotten like a full size one, and I was hoping that this e.l.f. eye primer would be good, so I wanted to try it out. And so I got the sheer one. There's also a white one, but I was like, eh, I don't know if I want to get that one. So I just got, like, the skin-colored one. So I'm hoping for good things from that. Okay, so that's the end of Target. Let's go Charming Charlie's, because I did talk about that a little bit. Okay, so going with the theme of the colors from my college, I got this yellow watch which I thought was adorable and I'm so excited to wear it on game days because it'll look so cute with my student shirt. Our student shirts are always yellow and so um and they're you know they're kind of bland and they're unisex and it's just like meh, you know wish they were a little bit more girly but you know whatever. So this will go great with that and also oh my gosh guys I'm so excited for this like look at this bad boy like ooh I am so excited for this. Like, I think it might cover up some of the student shirt, but I think it'll look so cute and it'll make it girly and pretty and I'll be very, very happy. So, that's everything from Charming Charlie's. Now, where I spent the most money was Ulta. So, let's get started with like some of the smaller stuff. Okay, so never worn falsies before. I, I'm kind of just getting into this makeup thing and so I'm hoping, you know, that I get better and better as time goes on. So I've heard a lot on YouTube. This could almost be like a YouTube made me do it uh, video, but I've heard an awful lot about Ardell lashes. And so I got the Ardell Natural Starter Kit with the 116 Black lashes um and I also got the Ardell Natural 109 black lashes and I think I'm really gonna like these ones if I can ever figure out how to put them on so those are exciting I also got three of the Revlon Color Burst Balm Stains so that's what that looks like this one is in Sweetheart what a cute name and it's like a really fun like Barbie pink color and then I also got the same thing in honey which is like a nudie pink type look I had this on my lips earlier but I'm pretty sure it's gone now but that's what it looks like and then this one's like I'm really excited for this is uh in romantic Ooh. and obviously it's a red and I'm very excited for this so I'm gonna be using these like the elf ones that I got from Target and then I also got the NYX HD Stu Studio Photogenic uh, finishing powder so that's what it looks like and it's a translucent uh, finishing powder and I really oh I just made a mesh uh, <laughs> um, it's a translucent powder it's a loose powder and yeah I needed one so I got it so that's that try not to spill it everywhere oh it's like bleh. okay made a mess okay now um, I already have a lot of these uh, color tattoos um made by Maybelline. I have Fat de Bronze, 
toughest hope and one other one but I wanted to get this one because I thought maybe it would be like a dupe for the Mac Painterly paint pot it's got a little bit of shimmer to it it is called barely branded so I'm hoping that I'm gonna be able to use this as like a base for eyeshadows so I'm excited about that and so here's where I was a bit naughty um, I got the Too Faced semi-sweet chocolate bar I, I don't have the original I plan on getting it but guys if they smell the smell of these eyeshadows I just can't even like they literally smell like chocolate and I love the packaging and I just, these colors though, these colors though, and I'm just, oh, oh. guys, like this, I'm, I'm just, oh, I'm so excited. So, I was thinking about maybe doing a tutorial type deal with this bad boy. So, yeah, I'm sure you've seen it before. It's been on YouTube for a little while, but finally got one myself it smells like chocolate and it's awesome and that's it that is my collective uh, beauty stuff haul um, if you haven't already go ahead and subscribe thumbs up this video if you like it and I'll see you next time bye